Hey everybody, just back with another video. So I do have a, just a short clip of Christian Freeland basically just absolutely deceiving and lying to Canadians. I know you guys hate her voice just as much as I do, but it's a quick video, but Pierre Polyev just dropped this on X and absolutely exposed her for the liar that she is. So let's have a look and then we'll talk about it after like usual. Oops, sorry. Some really good news that we have had just this week. Rents are coming down. Across the country, rent prices are up nearly 6% year over year. I've been renting now, I'm in my 30s for like around 15 years and things just keep getting worse. Most of my income goes to my rent. I have to move. I can't, I can't, I can't afford $2,700. I live by myself. I have to hope and pray that somebody can come and help me. Look, it's an exciting time. It is an exciting time for Canada. An exciting time for Canada, says Mark Carney, who is likely going to be the, le the next leader of the Liberal Party. But he's also exposing himself to show how much of an absolute clown and liar he is as well. But back to Christian Freeland, I mean, for her to have the balls to come out here and say that rent is going down when nobody, I mean, literally zero people would agree with that. Literally zero people think that rent is going down. I don't, I've never met a single person and I'll never meet someone who thinks that in right now during these times, rent is low or going down. Then they show the statistic, well, it's up at least 6% every year. Christian Freeland understands that when something increases, that means it goes up, not down, right? Now, is she really that stupid or is she just on purpose lying to Canadians Desperately trying to get their support back because it's dwindling like you've never seen before. Or is she actually just that stupid? I just, I, I just don't believe that anyone could be that stupid. When I said earlier that I've met zero people that actually think these things, that's because it's so stupid no one could possibly ever think it, which means she's doing all this on purpose. And they're going to come out here and say, oh, we care about Canadians and we, we want to put Canada first. Well, they do literally the opposite of that. And then accuse Pierre Polyev of potentially doing what they're already doing to Canadians. I mean, it's unbelievable that they haven't realized that this isn't going to work. Like, I don't know what desperate play they're going to get into, but I mean, let's be honest. They, they got to get desperate. They're, they seem desperate. They just think that, well, we've lied for nine years, we've lied through three elections, and we won all of them. Let's keep doing it. But, that being said, if you check out the polls, I mean, there's been no changes here, really, for the past few months. The, the Liberals are in a huge deficit, a hole that is way too big for them to crawl out of. And the Pierre Polyev Conservatives, the common sense progressive conservatives, as they, as they call themselves, are just blowing them out of the water. And that's going to continue because of garbage like this, because these clowns can't stop lying, and they're doing it on purpose. Let me know what you guys think in the comments section. I always enjoy engaging with you guys. Uh, also, please don't forget to like and subscribe, as it really does help grow the channel. Thanks again so much for watching, guys, and I'll be back shortly with a new video.